What? What was that? What was with? What was with the hand? I think it just broke my wrists. Okay, that's very okay. Hello everyone, my name's King Carva, and welcome back to Subnautica Full Release Episode 3, I think, right? Yes? Okay, uh, so, uh, yeah, last time we checked, uh, we're gonna make a Seamoth, we're gonna do that, that is the plan today. We make a Seamoth and explore the depths, let's get started. Ah, uh, this again, Oxygen really. Production okay, uh, emergency power when we're literally at 150%. Okay, that's fine. Well, uh, okay, we've got a good, good sized base. We got, uh, things charging. That's actually probably a good thing. Okay, we should probably just make another batter to have on the charger. Probably a good idea. So let's go get a nascent mushroom and go do that real quick. Hello, writhing weed. What is your dealio? Writhing weed. Well adapted to both shallow waters and cave systems, this plant lives in symbiosis with cholera. Yeah, so literally nothing. Gotcha. You are beautiful. Gotta say that. You are Never mind, you decided to disappear from existence. That's fine. I try to compliment something and it just ninja vanishes. Why are you barking? And simply enough, we just make a battery and put it on the charger. Uh, well, we should probably just... Repair tool, you're at 30%. Why don't we just put your battery on the charger? There we go. So now, we got all batteries charged up, and by the time uh, we come back for it, we'll have four good old batteries. Good for us. Huzzah. Now, the first thing we probably want to do is build a mobile vehicle bay to actually know what we need to build the Seamoth. Uh, for that, we need a power cell, titanium ingot. Titanium ingot, that's easy enough. We just get a whole ton of titanium. But a power cell, uh, that requires two batteries. Two batteries... And silicone rubber. Let's go get the silicone rubber, eh? Oh, Space Whale, are you, have you decided to exist? Good. Welcome to existence. Hello, Ch Charles! No, you're infected! Charles! Charles will save you, I swear. One day, you will be free. You'll be free from this curse. I don't know how, but you will. Dementia Starfish, you can go suck a giant bag of dukes. Okay, we have everything we need to build the, uh, whatchamacallit. And, uh, yeah. Let's do. Okay, first of all, we need this silicone rubber. I got the stuff to make fire mesh. God dang it! Okay, now we can actually, you know, build it. Yas. And I fully decided to build new batteries instead. And now let's get the titanium we need. Is this a joke? Okay, I'm just about ready to stab somebody. Please. Just give me my titanium ingot. Thank you. Thank you. Build it. Right. Right. We need the power cell. And now we can build the mobile vehicle bay. Ha freaking za. Yes. 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 Okay, let's do this. Be free, young one! Be free. Whee! Okay, get up. 
And what do we need to build the Seamoth? Titanium ingot, power cell, glass, and lubricant. Okay, so this is a lot of work. Well, uh, let's get to it, I guess. Okay, first off, we already have a creep vine seed cluster, so we can build that lubricant right now. And gotten. Uh, now we just need glass, a power cell, titanium ingots. Power cell. Both of you are now mine. Power cell, go. Now we just need glass and a titanium ingot. Let's do it. We have a new message and I think I know what it says. Let's get that Seamoth built first. Okay. Now let's finally just make this gla this last glass we need and let's make our Seamoth. Alright, let's do this. Seamoth. Create. Is a fast, safe mode of transport, but remember that swimming is good for your glutes and endorphin levels. Huh? Indeed it is. Indeed it is, Sheila. But it's not good for the soul. Welcome aboard, Captain. We have a new message. Tell me what it is. Oh. The captain is gone. I have assumed command. The last thing the captain did was give me coordinates for dry land. We regroup one and a half kilometers southwest of the crash site. Stay together and good luck. This message will now repeat. Rendezvous coordinates corrupted. Transmission origin coordinates downloaded. Huh. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Okay, well fine. What we will do is go find one of that moon bays or whatever, because we really need to be able to, you know, power this thing when it gets low, because it will get low on power. See, it's going down, and I have no way of refilling that. So, as a present anyway, we need to use the base's power to refill it. Meaning, we need to watch our power levels. So, I remember very, very acutely that the mushroom forest is where you get the uh, moon bay. So, we're going to head there. I believe there is one of those uh, if we go through this. Mushroom Forest, here it is. Now this forest is what we need. It has, it has the required material somewhere we just need to find it hello cyclops hole fragment that's good another cy cyclops piece cyclops bridge fragment in this area is dominated by glass. You don't say! Picking up faint, all terror vehicle signatures. Ow. I can't go much deeper than this. Ah! What are you? Lithium. Oh, that can be used to strengthen my base. You know, I was fairly certain this is where I got the moon bay from. Was I wrong? Hi, what are you? Modification station. I don't know what that is, but it's like a pole fragment. Ooh, whoa. Jelly Ray, you're cute. Uh, 
Hi. Moon pool fragment. This is what I'm looking for. I know it. I knew it. Okay, I just need one more. Hello, are you what I'm looking for? Yes, you are. Well, hello there. You are a great addition. This is exactly what I was looking for. Now we can actually power this thing up. Let's uh, let's head back to the base and build one of those, eh? Okay, first of all, what's it take to build a moon pool? Titanium ingot, lubricant, and lead. Okay, that's easy enough. First of all, let's get some food. Gary Fish, you're my next meal. Sorry. Peeper, you're also my next meal. Why are you just dumping into the ocean? You ever notice that peepers have this weird little, like, trail behind them? Like, they're, they're leaving something behind? It's very strange. Like, no other fish does that. See, see like, watch this fish. It, it doesn't. Or it could just disappear into the other. Oh, okay. Charge that up. Okay, now that we've eaten and drank our fill, uh, let's let's go and uh, get some titanium first. Cause uh, for the moon pool, we need exactly uh, a lubricant, lead. Lead's not gonna be hard to find. We just go into that area and titanium. We need a lot of titanium. Now, where where is my uh, where is my sea moth? Okay, now this makes it much easier to go into the depths. Like, seriously. Incredibly easier. I wish it could mine things, though. That'd be great. Lead! Just what we were looking for. Now we need another one. Hey, Demented Starfish, how you doing? Ow! Things are... Or I'm crashing in. Oh, poor fish. Okay, we got a new message, but we want the moon pool first. Sheila, I don't need to know every time I go over 100 meters, please. What? Oh, demented starfish, leave me alone. Oh, what did that just bump into? You could have lead. Lead! There it is. Okay, now we need lubricant. Can we get that from here? We do need lubricant, right? Yes, we do. We get lubricant from these things. Okay, now we should have everything we could possibly need to build this moon bay. Let's do it. Oh, I just got rammed by my sea moth. That's okay. Yeah, boy. <laughs> this is where it's at. And we should have everything we need, right? Let's uh let's see. Yes, we do. Let's build ourselves a moon bay, ladies and gents. Right here. Okay. Slight technical difficulties. What are you building over there? Okay, uh, reinforcements. We just need a bit of titanium. That's that's easy to get, right? Yeah, we already have the lithium. No, 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 no. Come on, come on. We we need to get our titanium before the base implodes. Hello, sheeps. You're saying ah. Thank you. Okay, reinforcement. Build it right there. Reinforce the base. 
Okay, now let's repair any damage. Where's the damage? You. Damage. You. Damage. You. Damage. This is a nice room. Also, the fact that it's not keeping water out. That's not a... What the heck? You know, we should just, like jam pack our base of reinforcements just so that we have like 90 uh, repair amount or whatever. Ooh, that one's really hurt. Hull integrity restored. No it isn't. Training systems initiated. Now it is. Okay, now we're finally all drained up. Uh, let's get our Seamoth in there. Wherever the hell it is. Probably just outside the base. Hi, I was right. Oh wow, we can repair a seamoth. Let's do that. Now enter. Welcome aboard, Captain. Okay, we need to get you all powered up and spiffy. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. It's twice I've been told welcome aboard. Upgrades, huh? Can we can we name you? That'd be great. Energy charging, 83... Wow, this thing charges fast! That's good. So, uh, yeah. While the sea moth charges, we're going to go out and, uh... Get some food, get some water. We just... We're gonna prepare for the long trip. Away from the base. Because we do not want to thirst to death. That's never a good thing. So, uh... Yeah, we need a whole bunch of salt... Uh, so I'm gonna go to the Overwatch forums for that, and we need a whole bunch of coral or whatever. So let's get to it. Ooh. Oh. Ow! What? What is hurting me? I just want to scan you. Stop! Stop, man! I just, I just want to scan, man. Fine, fine. I don't get to scan. That's that's fine. Okay, so now we're gonna make a metric ton of water. Oh god, a bleach makes two. Yeah, we're just gonna have endless supplies of water for our trip. That's fine. How much is it gonna actually total up to? I'm, I'm a little scared of this. Oh dear. I didn't realize it made two. Uh, why is our... Oh, right. Power goes down whenever we make something. So, yeah. I think we're good on water. Let's drink a bit. <coughs> and we have enough to get food when we need it. And, uh, can, can we just get, get rid of that? Thanks. No. Okay. So now, let's finally go and, uh, answer the call of nature. And, uh, you know, go watch a ship get exploded. Online. Good to know. Uh, Bob. I don't know what to call you. You sound more manly than uh, Sheila, so I'm gonna call you Bob. Okay, Bob. We're good. Yeah, we're good. Okay, let's uh, let let's hear this guy. Aurora, we're approaching the planet now. We have a landing site for you. That's well, it's better than the alternatives. We've sent you the court. Okay, cool. It'll take us a couple of days to align our orbit. Should be able to establish direct contact with you during that time. Then we're coming in to get you. Cross your fingers, the weather holds. Don't leave us waiting. Sunbeam out. Okay, we should probably do a self-scan right now. We're normal. Wow. We're just not... Oh, we're, we're normal. That's, that's cool. Welcome aboard, Captain. Uh, so, yeah. We have all the water necessary. Ooh, wait. Now we have the health necessary, too. Uh, okay. Let's head to the Sunbeam landing site. Let's go. Let's stick near the surface, though. We don't want any surprises. Like, if there's any big Joffrey creatures, uh, we don't want anything big bad happening. That's never a good thing. Can we see the island yet? No, but we can see something weird sticking out of the... Oh, hi, island. 
Hi, gun! It's all cool. We're all cool, right? Cool. Good. Why did I get another message? I can't answer that. I'm sorry. I'm busy. I'm a busy man with busy plans for the future of world domination. I don't know. Okay. Detecting massive energy signature in the region. Cannot identify. Okay, can can we uh just kind of leave this here and it won't go anywhere? Will you be good? Will you be good? That's the question I have. I really hope so. And why can I see my pod? Hi pod. How are you? Okay. And now we're here on a desolate island with only one goal. And that's to see what the hell this is about. Hello, head crab. How are you? You want to kill me? That's, that's fine. Hello! You're cute. I'll use you in something else, though. First, let's go say hi to Joffrey. Hello, Joffrey. Uh, I, I just, I just, oh, God. I just wanted to say hi. I don't know what you are, but you terrify me. You're very large, and you just sit here at the edge of this cliff, always. Not really doing anything. I'm not going to approach you because I'm not that stupid. But, uh, yeah, you have a nice day, Joffrey. Uh, yeah, have a nice day. Okay, let's see. Are we are we uninfected? Uh, oh. Foreign bacteria we are infected. Statistically significant levels. No adverse effects detected. Be vigilant for symptoms. Well, uh, that's a good thing. Force field control. Scanning. What do you say? Force field control. This device matches no known technologies like the alien in nature. Power is being routed via the terminal to a nearby force field. The technology is far beyond anything encountered before by the Federation. Nonetheless, there is a good chance it functions like a regular lock and only requires the correct kind of key. Well, <laughs> I didn't know that. Scans indicate this structure is composed of a metal alloy with unprecedented integrity. Okay. No match is found in database performing structural analysis. Okay, sounds good to me. This place is nice. Ancient technology has got an achievement. Hi. Give me your data. Unknown language. Attempting translation. Here we go. Alien data terminal. Discovered inside an alien facility is not possible to translate any useful information. However, scans have returned some information from the device itself. It is likely a solid state computer, although there is no clear way to interface with it. On approach, it began producing a low frequency radio wave containing complex but recognizable data patterns. It is likely the alien species which designed this technology evolved or genetically selected sensory apparatus to hear and understand the information being broadcast by the device and communicate back. The mental processing power required to form this kind of telepathy would imply the designers were considerably more physiologically developed than the common human for the research required. Let's continue. Hello, Cube. I like you. Because you allow me... Analysis of oh. the patterns on the walls cannot ascertain whether their purpose is aesthetic or functional. Further data required. Okay, let's get another one of these cubes. It can't be a bad thing to take cubes, right? Right? Yeah, data terminal. Unknown language, attempting Unknown translation. Language. Oh, yeah. Attempting translation. What do you say? Enforcement platform schematic. This data appears to be a multi-dimensional multi-dimensional okay schematic of some kind by mapping the pattern to three-dimensional space it is possible to gather a basic understanding of this facility's internal workings construction materials the facility's unknown construction material is identified as an ultra hard non-reactive metal amalgam synthesized from off-world materials there is no indication it can be damaged or destroyed by available means power schematic indicates the facility was to be powered by a separate self-sustaining power plant located elsewhere on the planet Location is not listed, but there is evidence the designers intended to harness the planet's natural thermal energy. 
Layout. The facility consists of an upper engineering system where the schematic was found and the control room, which is accessed via security sealed elevator shaft or a separate underwater moon pool. The con control. The control room in the lower section houses the only known way to interface with the facility. However, the schematic does not detail the operation procedure and installed security measures. Oh well, buddy, let's go! Your best probability Whee! of interfacing with this facility is achieved by accessing the control room. Nah, I didn't just read that. Hello. Hey, there's no field here. It's, oh, it's, that's different than before. I remember there being a field here. Hello, moon pool. I feel like you. Whoa. I feel like you could house a much larger submarine than I can build. Huh? Huh? Greetings upon you. Le oh, take it. Also, let's scan this thing. What are you? Ion Cube. This green mineral substance has no entry on the periodic table and an unprecedented ability to store huge amounts of ionic energy within it. Likely grown artificially. Cubic appearance suggested has been cut from a larger deposit. Each cube contains the equivalent ionic energy of 5 kilotons of TNT. Under the right conditions, the energy could be released in a controlled manner. Likely, ugh, likely used as batteries, but will require a substantial power source to be recharged. Valuable energy source. Keep it. Take it. It's mine. Not sure what I could use with it, but uh, something, clearly. Okay, well, let's go into this control room, eh? Scans indicate the facility's control room lies beyond this. Put a tablet in. Shoop, do whoop. Well, hello. Night. This is a nice room you got here. It'd be a shame if someone uh exploded it. Too bad I can't. Good thing the Seamoth isn't moving. That would be most unfortunate. Hi! Poke it! And now you're gonna poke me! Hi! Hello! Oh no! Oh! Oh! Okay, that... That was my wrist. Very, very likely that would cause blood loss on an insane level. The control panel is broadcasting a message. Translation reads... Warning, infected individuals may not disable the weapon. This planet is under quarantine. Oh. The weapon, you say. Well, 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 it's gonna go great for the sunbeam, isn't it? Hey, what are you? You're a thing. What is this? What? Hey, alien device. Okay, what it Doomsday device. Scans indicate that this device contains enough potential energy to destroy the entire planet, along with the solar system. Unfortunately, it has malfunctioned. Well, we're staying the hell away from that. Okay, that's a that's a doomsday. Okay. Hello, what's in this room? It's a portal that no one can actually go through. Right. Okay, back to the surface. Okay, so it would seem we need some food. So uh, let's go find a pepper uh, and uh, eat him. Raw. Hi, you're cute. Can I eat you? You'll do. We're just gonna. We're just gonna chop. Or not? Oh, we're just gonna chow down on you. Vital signs stabilizing. And uh, now let's go through that portal upstairs to get the good old, good old Mert multi-purpose room. Yeehaw, mother truckers! You are a very large bulbo tree. What are you? Bulbo tree, a bulb-based floor which roots to the ground and sport edible, high water content. What, what do you mean you're edible? Oh!
Oh, you're edible. Hello, you're beautiful. And you have a lot of water too, so... Wow. All you need to do is attack a tree with a knife and it gives you food. Who knew? Okay, so eventually you can destroy a tree. Good to know. Head crabs. Don't make me fight you to the death. I have a knife. Fine, fine. Let, you you, you want to go, but... <gasps> just die. And now, through the portal. Let's -a go. Yep. Poke. Okay. Well, that was fun. Fun for the whole family. Now we've headed the exact opposite direction. Let's get to scanning literally everything in sight. Speckled Rattler, what are you? Speckled Rattler, a brittle land plant containing large spores that generate a characteristic rattle when the plant is shaking. This may... no. Nothing useful there. Pink Cap, are you useful? Pink Cap. Inedible. Not useful at all. Gotcha. Okay. Well, I know these trees are edible. Or not. No, they're not. I lied. Okay, well, we're not going to accomplish anything during nighttime because we can't really Looking see anything. So, uh, let's wait. Okay, looks like it's just finally about morning. Jaffa Cup, what are you? Are you edible? I don't care about you. What are you, and can I eat you? Ming plant? No. Okay, if I recall correctly, at the peaks of the mountains, there are the buildings that we require. Yep, there it is. So we need to somehow get to the peak of this mountain. Let's do it. Hello, path to the mountaintop. Yes, we are now going to get the best type of room in the game. And with that being the multi-purpose room, because we need a purpose that is multiple. And there's another one over there, and let's, uh, yeah. Stasis rifle. We have one of those, don't we? We've already got a piece of that? No, we don't. It's in here. Hey, another stasis rifle. We now know how to build a stasis rifle, whatever the hell that means. Blueprint. Bulkhead. That's probably good, right? Yeah. Spotlight. Lights on the base! Yes! Well, that surely will cost a lot of power. Supply crate, give me some water. Cool. Lantern tree. Ah, yes, the lantern tree. Excellent. Excellent source of protein. Not indoor grow bed. That is one. That is something we need. Oh yeah, the, the room itself. Observatory. Okay, now we have an observatory too. And a fern palm. We're just we're just here scanning everything in sight. Hi, abandoned PDA. What do you have? Bart Togel's log. Integrating new PDA data. What? This is the first time I've seen sunlight in months. After all that time in the deep, I'd been dreaming of it. Now that I'm back here, I'm finding it hard to enjoy alone. My father was right. We should never have left this place. We shouldn't have gone so deep. They do not want us down there. Despite my best efforts, ill health is taking hold of me. The visions are getting worse. Visions? Marguerite and father are now part of the ecosystem of this incredible planet. It's reassuring to know that when I go, 
I'll join them. Until then, well, there's always the view. Okay, well, that's not disheartening at all. That's not, that's not bad at all. Nope. No, not bad at all. What did he mean by part of the ecosystem? And voices as goddess of the sea? Is that what it's talking about? Is that, is that what we're going on about now? Sea goddesses? I don't know. Huh? This is like the longest, windiest path in the universe. Okay, what does this have for me? Marble melon. And... We also should probably get the thing to be able to build plants. Chinese potato. I mean, that doesn't look Chinese, but hey. Hmm. Swivel chair, just what we needed. Oh look, an another PDA. What do you have to say? The gassy voice log. This island is a godsend. Look out of the window. No predators. Fresh food. No building materials. Nothing left of the ship. And your kid says we're gonna starve without more grow beds. Speak up, kid. It's true, father. The natural growth rates are too slow to keep supporting us. All I'm saying is oceans got us surrounded. No use hiding. Sooner or later, we'll get our feet wet. The rest of your life may have been a fight made up, but I've made my decision. You want to forfeit your emergency pay to take a swim? Go ahead. Believe me, I'm thinking on it. Okay, something happened to these people. Integrating new PDA data. Something definitely happened to these people. Oh great, I've got a desk. You whoop de do. Acquired. Oh, that's that's really far down. Okay, let's uh, not jump off the cliff to our doom. Let's sidle down the cliff to our goodness. That is the multi-purpose room, and that is what we want. We came here to find. Yes! Okay, now we finally actually have a god dang multi-purpose room. That's oh, an amazing thing. And a wall planter. Wow, we're just gonna fill our house with plants. Use the ladder. Okay! Hi! <clears throat> please just die. Please, 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 at your earliest convenience, can you just die? Thank you. What's in here? Battery. Good. Bannon PDA. Paul Targo's log. Again. Chief's log. Five weeks since the crash. The only other survivors are my son, Bart, and Mida, the cut price mercenary I commissioned for the journey. After days drifting in the life pod, rain hammering on the roof, the weather cleared and we washed up here. I had made a salvage the Degazi wreck, set Bart to finding us a stable source of food. His education is paying off sooner than I'd anticipated. Our only problem is Mida. She says the weather's going to turn. I say she's finding excuses to risk our mm. lives. I imagine she's not gonna weaken her life without a physical altercation, and she's itching for a fight. In every judgment she makes, things go from bad to worse. If she had my experience, she'd have more faith. Humans have spent millennia specializing in how to shackle nature to our will. <laughs> this planet won't cause us any new problems. My one task now is to keep us alive as comfortably as possible until the insurance company arranges rescue. In this part of space, that could be months or even years. Oh, you never got it, buddy. What's on this one? Number two. Into Son, I said wait for the storm to pass. Your life's more valuable to me than a plant patch. You stopped being in charge when the ship you were captaining sunk. I'll stop being in charge when you take charge of yourself. Say, Chief. Chief. What? 
You know how to drain those grow beds of 40 tons of stormwater? Or how to conjure food from the air? I know how to prioritize. I'm just saying, if that's so, what's your boy's life worth to you today? If tomorrow you're gonna be so hungry you start wondering what it tastes like, let him go deal with the plants. Son, go deal with the plants. I will leave you here. Do you understand me? No rescue coming, Chief. Not in time. And no staying here, neither. This rain keeps falling. Sooner or later, this place will be buried. The only choice we got is whether to get buried with it. Okay, so something really bad happening to, to these guys, and that's really unfortunate. Where, where do I go? Okay. Oof! Come on, you stupid. Integrating new PDA data. Okay, finally. What is that thing? I don't know. I found it outside in the sand. Uh, part of another ship? None I've ever seen. It's not even scratched. Uh, uh, don't fool around with it. It might be worth something. Stand down, Chief. If it were going to crumble to dust, it would have done so when I picked it up. It's glowing. We're not the first people to come to this planet. People. Maybe. Could be aliens. Could be the damn sea monsters for all we know. One thing for sure, we ain't gonna find out by staying here. Okay. Well, it's, it's just another purple tablet. We don't need oh. another... Excuse me? A th you're supposed to be dead. Thought you were dead, man. By the way, I think that's all we're gonna get from this. Oh, right. The outdoor planter. Probably a good thing. Okay, now, I think that's all we're getting from this area. We only have seven minutes left, so... Let's head back. Oh, wow. They increased the size of the entrance. That's... Really good, actually. <gasps> Hacking, I guess. Okay. What, what was that? What was with... What was it, the hand? I think it just broke my wrists. Okay. That's very... St okay. Shale outcrop. Gold, no. <laughs> See if we can't get more of that lithium that I know happens on this... Speak of the devil. Gold. No. Lithium. We want quite a bit of lithium just to make our base nice and strong. Oh my god, I just found diamond! Property of the All Terra Corporation. You will be liable to reimburse the full market price. Your current bill stands at 3 million credits. Oh my god! Diamond! I, I remember that's that's required for the laser cutter. I couldn't find it anywhere. And here it was all along. Wow. Okay, wow, I am very happy about that. Now we can actually go to the laser cutter. Maybe soon uh, we can actually, you know, go to the ship. Okay, and now it would seem all we can do is wait. Wait for the sun meme to arrive and for what happens to happen. So this is going to become daytime because uh, I don't like watching a ship explode at night. I mean, that could be cool, I guess. Cute. Oh. Well. Oh. Here we are. Survivor, we see you. Man, I don't know how you held out down there. We broke an atmosphere, and we're descending towards the landing site. I don't... I don't. Is that a building down there? There he is. What do you mean you can't identify him? Hold on. No turning back now. Positions, everyone. Touching down in 10, 9, 8. It 
it's coming from the building. Change oh, now this is just dramatic. Oh. Isn't that just dramatic? A new day dawns. Hmm. <sighs> Alright, as a new day dawns within the world of Subnautica, I'm going to finally end this episode here. I love you all very much, and uh, hope you enjoyed this. Uh, see you next Monday. Oh, you're, you're finally heading back. Okay, cool. Interrupt me. That's fine. Anyway, peace, guys. Peace.